Yes, all the way. Welcome to the Biz for Good Show, where we highlight misfits, outcasts, what? and renegades for the being good and doing good movement. We spotlight people that are changing the world by having integrity and honesty and creating an environment of connection, thus showing the true secret to success and creating a life of greater impact. So come on board and create your own Biz for Good life. Welcome to, welcome to the Biz for Good Show! Welcome, welcome! I am your host, Bobby Glenn James, along with the Ryan Pilkington, ladies and gentlemen, the one, the only, Ryan Pilkington! Tell us about the show, Ryan. Man, <laughs> when I first started this, I didn't have an ego, now I have a huge one. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> Did you also have eardrums before you started this? Talk? Huh? I can't hear I, after that intro. What? Huh? What'd huh? you say? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, I'm calm today, man. I'm totally You're calm. Totally calm. Totally calm today. All right. Well, thanks. For Remember being that thing I said I was being too crazy, and yeah. I, or no, I was being not crazy enough, and, and I just need to up, go uh, step it up. Now I've decided maybe I should tone it down. No, no, I think I should still just, just be me. Just be you. Yep. Yep. That's all you can do. That's all you can do, people. Just be you. Dot com. <laughs> good job. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, thanks for being uh, on another crazy, crazy episode of the Biz for the Good crazy. Show. Crazy. I like crazy. crazy. See, we like crazy. to make up words. The crazy. word of the day today crazy. on the Biz for Good Show it's is crazy. 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 Spell that. Crazy. Crazy. K R A Y. He's our. He's our speller. Uh, how do you K-R-A-Y. spell crazy? Spell made up words. C R A Y L Y. There you go. Crayley. Okay, you heard that, producer Ileana, when you write the notes. Crayley is spelled C R A Y L Y. There you go. Crayley. Crayley. And and it's Crayley. and what is it? It's like crazy, but, but a little bit crazier. It's crazier than crazy? It's I Crayley. think it's more laid back crazy. Oh, it's Crayley. Crayley? Cray- it's a cooler crazy. It's a cooler crazy. Yes. See, that's why Cedric is here. The element. That's, that's why we have a millennial in the house, millennial. so we can totally hook up with what our meanings that we make up are. So, crazy is the word of the day for the Biz for Good show. I think that word's going to show up on an Urban Dictionary, like, by Friday. You, you are so <laughs> crazy, man. I just love your craziness. You, you've heard it first on the Biz for Good show. <laughs> <laughs> this is where it all, they'll, in 30 years, they'll play this episode. And yeah. go, this is where it all started. started. Man, that's crazy. <laughs> 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 okay, enough. We see, we always get up. That's how we do it. Hey, if you can't have fun, people, if you can't have fun in life, uh, then it's boring. When and you're crazy. Yeah. <laughs> no, you're not no. crazy, because crazy's cool, baby. Oh, man. It's cool I, crazy, man. I invented the word, and I don't even know what it means. You're cray less. <laughs> oh, cray less. <laughs> okay. Don't be crayless. Don't be crayless. Be crayly, baby. All right, I got to rope that, this that's in That's going to be an Instagram. Gotta rope this we got to hook that up. All right, we're, uh, we're on stuff. episode 97. We have three more till 100. Ooh, are you yeah. doing something fun on 100? Oh, yes. We're going to have a big, giant party. Dude, you should have told me to wait three weeks. And Whoa. and and then I could have been, been on your one hundredth. Ep- I'm coming come back. Come on the. We'll have everybody. Oh, yeah. well, I thought we were going to have Blair. Who's Blair? Blair Nicole. <laughs> she she was our first episode. Oh, okay. That that wouldn't that nice. be cool? Yeah. yeah, she's done a lot of crazy stuff since then. <laughs> that was two years ago. I I That's hope Blair idea. would be up for it. That would you be fun. And then we're gonna go have a party. Yeah. You want you up for a party yes, on please. our hundredth episode? Yes, please. You you come in, Cedric. Yes. It's gonna be a bash. Be a Some pla- <laughs> It's gonna be crazy. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be crazy. Oh, oh man, goodness. that's stuck. I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna use that. I don't know. I'm thinking we go to uh, Joy Luck. Joy Luck for the party. What's okay. That? Joy Luck is a restaurant, and it has this little meeting. It has this little room that we could have all to ourselves. The waiter dude, he's amazing. He is cool. He's like a robot. Han. Yeah. Han. Yeah. Is it yeah. Chinese? Oh yep. yeah. It's oh, awesome. it's good. It's good. I food. love Chinese. Food. You do love. Oh, to, okay, yeah. we're in. We're at Han. <laughs> all right. Well, uh, I mean, not Han. We're at Joy Luck. Joy Luck. Oh, man. <laughs> With, With Han, Han rocks. With Han. With oh, Han. Oh, boy. 
I don't even know what to do. Now. <laughs> we're we're on episode ninety seven of the Best for Good Show. The title is How to Get Everything You Want with Everything Keller. Everything you Keller. want, people. How to get everything, everything you want with <laughs> Kelly Walker. <laughs> dot com. <laughs> is there KellyWalker dot com? Do you have that? Somebody has it. Oh, that's right. And it's like an accounting firm, which makes me want to cry. Oh, that's sad. Kelly it's Walker. It's like the anti Kelly Walker. So, what's your what's your website? I love awesome dot com. Are you kidding me? I'm not kidding. What? Really? I love awesome oh, that's dot com. <laughs> that is so crazy. Do I you think love it. Fits? it. I it think is it fits so me. awesome. <laughs> I love awesome dot com. So much better. Yeah. Thank you. I like it too. Oh, I'm supposed to do something. Uh, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Biz for Good show. We are two fun, adventurous entrepreneurs sharing the experiences of the real secret to business success, doing all things with a be good, do good mindset. There is so much bad noise in the world. Let's fight against the noise by spreading the good, good against the noise, people. Find us on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, Twitter. Our Instagramians, we love you. We love you. Tweeters, Twitters, and Facebookians, and Insta Instas. Insta Instas, uh, find us. And don't forget to subscribe to The Biz for Good Show on all the great podcasting outlets out there iTunes, Stitcher, and tell Alexa, subscribe to Biz for Good Show. And give us reviews. We all love some reviews. Some reviews. Good ones, obviously. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> if you don't like the show, don't worry about the reviews. It's fine. <laughs> Just don't listen. <laughs> Unless you, you enjoy listening to things you hate, then yeah, go no, for it. Don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah. Where are we going with this? <laughs> I'm going to talk about Kelly Walker. Oh, yes, yes, yes. I am awesome. Dot com. Dot com. Dude, I love exactly. awesome. I, Not, I love awesome. I love awesome. Dot com. You need to write that on I love your wall. Awesome. Write, I love awesome. I'll write com. that on your wall if I can find a spot. Yeah. It's pretty it's full. It's running out of real estate. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Kelly Walker has a driving desire to bring joy and sparkles to the world. She has overcome decades of people pleasing. Decades. 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 Well, you found out how pleasing. old I was today. Decades of De- people pleasing. Two decades. <laughs> and discounting she's, her she's own. She's 23. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, She was pleasing at three years old. What? (laughs) Oh, my goodness. Okay. She has overcome decades of people pleasing. She's bugging you, too. This is great. I'm not going to get through any of this. You want me to read that for you? Yeah, you just Just go for it. You read it. You're doing great. Kelly Walker has a driving (laughs) desire to bring joy and sparkles to the world. She She does. She has overcome decades of people pleasing and discounting her own dreams and feelings to recognize her personal worth. Now she embraces and boldly lives her purpose with making a difference. Boldly in the world. lives. She's boldly gone where no woman has gone before in a loving world of awesome. Awesomeness. She is currently working on her first book, From Checked Out to Changing Lives How I Went from a Depressed Mess to a Motivational Speaker in Less Than a Year. And uh, so can you. I was there for her transformation. You. He was there for my very. Well, you were I was there, there too. Yeah. <laughs> my very first. She kicked it out of the speaking park. Speaking adventure. Blew yeah. it out of the park. I, Thank you. I didn't know. I thought it was your like fourth, yeah, fifth time. Very speak. professional lady Thank here. You. you know, there's a lot of speakers in the world, but not everybody makes an impact on stage. Yep. And you do. Thanks. At least you did then. And since I <laughs> hang out with Bobby, I see a lot of speakers. So. Yeah. You might suck now. Is that what you're saying? No, oh, I don't. You I'm were not, good then, but. <laughs> Just say, you could have gotten jaded. I mean, you know, the, that world can jade you. Egos. In, any kind of entertainment world. Yeah. Not that a speaker, a speaker is an entertainer. Oh, whether definitely. you Whether you want to be or not, a speaker is absolutely an entertainer. It's true. At least they should be, if they want to make if an impact. If they're not. It yeah. says that you love to travel and learn languages and teach everyone she can. Teach everyone she can. There we go. <laughs> Gosh, yes. you can teach me to speak. That's what <laughs> she we loves mean. to teach everyone she can. She knows seventeen different languages. Is that correct? Three, three. Well, I was close. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, uh, there's like 120 languages in the world, so someday. I was closer. Yeah. someday. <laughs> someday. That's awesome. That's my goal. What, what languages are the three? French, French, French Spanish, 
Spanish. And English. And English. I'm still English. working on English personally. I yeah. Know. I know a little sign language too. I'm trying to oh. learn how to read. I love, I love you. you. All right, we're going to do a Google challenge, everybody. Oh, oh we're going to go into, we're doing the Google challenge first. Bring it. We're bringing. Bring it, Google. I'm like a lot of times, for some reason, I got all crazy, and I told Kelly about what it is. Yeah, you prep. I'm it. glad. I'm uh, really excited. <laughs> yeah, I had a feeling she would really enjoy I'm it I'm going to kick it. Google's trash. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, it's on, Bring people. it, Google. Google's got nothing on this lady. All right, folks, we are putting in the title, How to Get Everything You Want into Google right now. Ryan has put it in. How to get everything you want and he is now clicking on page three. Why do you pick page three? Because nobody goes there. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> because, hey, come on, let's be interesting. Now we want to find a not ad, which it looks like there are no ads. Audible, self-development, how to. That sounds lame. Oh, five ways to give everything. I don't know. Get, that's, that's everything it. you need. That's oh. not quite the same. What about this one? How to get everything you want. By goals. By yeah, goals. Just click on it. We can't, we can't, we can't, we can't focus on it too much. We just have to go with it. Um, oh no, it's, it's a, a book it's app. a book. Nah, don't do that. Right. Keep That's a book. Audible. That's, a book. That's the same. Looks like Brian Tracy has the. Uh, he's wrapped up the whole get everything you want <laughs> space. Let's do need, and then let's see if 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 it. It connects with you. All right. If it doesn't, then great. I mean, you have something to really kick this out of the park <laughs> with. So number one, open the door to infinite possibilities by helping others. Okay. Oh, whoa. That is actually you really good. Bam. Piss for good. Okay, these people. Uh, okay, you've got a I challenge. Like you've got a little bit of a challenge no, like here. That. You can get almost everything in life you need if you simply help enough people around you get what they need. The most prolific work is found in the challenge of okay we got to keep this we got to we got to put this on uh, on facebook ends it's yeah. it's one of life's greatest paradoxes when you help others you end up benefiting as much if not sign up for 30 days <laughs> They had a pop up come up. Oops. <laughs> when you help others, you end up benefiting as much, if not more, than those you have helped, and that is so true. That's that's why we started Absolutely. the show. That's why we believe that being good and doing good is the best business model in the world. If you want to keep clients and have happy employees, I totally. What's agree. the next one? Good job, Google. Dedicate time to meaningful work. Hmm. When driving. When deprived of passion and meaningful work, human beings lose their reason for living. They get lost and go frantically mad. That's so true. There's so many people in this country that get out of bed every morning and hate what they do. Yes. And I've made it my, my whole world and passion to, to assist folks in, in getting out of that. Because it's sad. I love my life. I love getting up in the morning. I love everything that I do every day. I mean, yeah, there's some work stuff and there's things, but for the most part, I love it. And I want, it, there's so much more fulfilling in life. Yeah, Why go too. through life waiting for the weekend so right. you can get drunk and not think about stuff? Oh, that's so sad. It is. <laughs> you okay. just brought this down like five notches. <laughs> Ryan's crying. Okay, I'll shut up. <laughs> Number three, be willing to be vulnerable, Miss Benet Brown coming out right now. Right oh, there. Are you a fan? Did you know that she's my spirit animal? She's spirit animal. Wait. Brene Brown is The lady my is your animal. spirit animal. What? <laughs> Brene Brown. Hey, she don't has, tell her. I she say might. That all the time. She might think that that's weird. I, didn't I think know she would actually, love it. I think she probably. I think would. she would love it. She probably would love it. Uh, that's awesome. She is your spirit animal. She is. I, uh, one of my. She's your spirit human. I guess she okay. is an animal. Okay. One of my big goals in life is to be friends with Brene Brown. Oh. Hey. Hey. We should have her Brene. on the show. She lives we in Houston. I, I'm. I might. I know she's a Texan. Yeah. Very fellow kindly. Texan. Very yep. kindly. See, she'll like me because I'm a fellow Texan. Yeah, what kind. happens when people open their hearts and minds? They experience, they love, they learn, they grow. That's what vulnerability is. The openness to possibility. Love is vulnerability. Happiness is vulnerability. The risk of being vulnerable is the price of opening yourself to a beautiful opportunity. Beautiful. That's awesome. I agree with that, too. Yep. Okay. These, this is going to be a hard one to beat. Ask <laughs> yourself the right questions. 
Stop looking outside yourself for the answers. Start asking yourself the right questions. Voltaire once said, judge a man by his questions rather than by his answers. That is good. (laughs) Okay, Google. This is one of the better page threes we've ever found. Yeah, Google's rocking it. Ask yourself the right question. Yeah, we got questions. I'm good. Let's 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 go to Who it's am number I? five. What Who am I? I? What do I need? How do I function best? What do I have to give? What's the next step I can take to make to take it right? I can't talk today. <laughs> <laughs> I can't even say crazy. Coolio. That's okay. You started a whole new Crayley. word. Crayley. 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 So it's it's okay. a movement. Yeah. yeah, I mean that's we'll always remember that at your funeral, Ryan, twenty thousand years from now, we'll <laughs> talk about. Yeah, he's the one that came up with Crayley. That's right. Okay, number five. Take a few tiny steps forward every single day. I do that. Tiny steps forward. That's pretty much, yeah. Yeah, my little counter says 10,000 tiny little steps a day, and I'll be healthier. Mm-hmm. How many do you have today? I don't know. I, I don't really have a stepper thing. I just said that because I had one at some time <laughs> back in the day. I remember those. I remember back when we used those pedometers. Yeah. yeah. Just clicked it on your yeah. thing. Yeah, you had one. They had a digital. Now it's all on your phone. Who cares? It's yeah. like everything. Fitbit. Fitbit. Yeah, Fitbit. Yeah, Fitbit. Fitbit. Never had one. Fitbit. Fitbit. But I did have a, ca- a, a, a walk counter or something. This, this is good right here. They'll read this part. Don't build mountains in your mind. Don't try to conquer the world all at once. When you, sink in, when you seek instant gratification, you make life unnecessarily painful and frustrating mm. that's that's what i do yes Dang that mountains. is good just piece it by piece that's why I, 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 when whenever you get overwhelmed mm-hmm. just do something a little yes. something it's amazing because 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 i know i do it i get flooded and overwhelmed and i just want to sit and mm-hmm. do absolutely nothing but if you can just push yourself to do some little thing to move mm-hmm. forward it snowballs. It, it, it picks it up. So It gives you accomplishment energy. Accomplishment energy. Instead of give up energy, which is crappy. Can yeah. I say crappy? Yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Okay. Crappy, we have decided. I said uh, poopy we, last week. Yeah, we can you only. You said what last week? Poop. Yeah. So we. <laughs> poop. <laughs> One of these days we're going to have a really colorful person on that says the F-bomb 14 times. And I don't know what we'll do then. I'll just have go. you had Travis Beep. Brady on? Beep. No, we haven't had Travis Brady on. Is he pretty... He's pretty languagey. You'll get it if you have him. Oh, he's an interesting fella, Travis Brady. I love him, but yes. Yeah, F-bomb he, will happen. Oh, that's interesting. <laughs> he's, he's a pretty intense dude. All righty. So how did we do on the Google Challenge? Oh, no, well, we Dude. haven't finished. She's oh, got to give her feedback Google, now. Okay. Google rocked it. Yeah. Those aren't the things that I would have said, but I agree with all of those. So give us a little bit of a... A little bit of an insight into what we're going to be talking about. What just a little bit? Yeah, just, just a little a bit sneak of peek. Yours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it kind of all comes down to your inner chatter. Inner chatter. Inner chatter. Which I have a friend that calls it monkey chatter, which cracks me up. Monkey chatter? Monkey I like chatter. Monkey chatter. Yeah. So Mine's the, a baboon chatter. <laughs> so you're so Gorilla chatter! <laughs> 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 No, I can't do it. My gorilla told me I can't do it. <laughs> Your inner gorilla. My inner gorilla. <laughs> the heck with monkey shatter. The giant gorilla is on my back. Okay, I'm sorry. We totally hijacked you. <laughs> That's all right. That's I can handle it. I can handle you guys. <laughs> good. Uh, you know, she can. She can. Yeah, handle. I She's totally fine. can. Absolutely. She's doing a good job. Thank you. <laughs> so, yeah, the inner voice in your head... Um, I, I teach ways to um, make it nice. Ooh. You mean tame the gorilla in your head? Sort of. So there's this little thing in the back of your brain called the reticular activating system. Ooh, I've heard reticular of that. Reticular yeah. Yes, the reticular. And that's what determines what you notice in life. And the way you write what goes on. So you 200 things at a time you can notice per second. Ooh. That's how much it lets through. And so you control what it lets through by what you think about and by your inner chatter. Mindfulness, people. Yep. It's all about mindfulness. Give me a high five. Mm. Bam. 
Yeah. Mindfulness. Absolutely. What yeah. you think about is what you see and what you become. Exactly. Absolutely. What you focus on it's grows. It's wisdom. It's wisdom five. Dude. Another <laughs> high five. Bam. Bam. Awesome. Down low. Down low. She's rocking it. She's rocking it. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the show. We would like to officially introduce Kelly Walker. Wow. Not dot com. But I love what? awesome. Dot com. I love awesome. Dot com. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us about yourself, Kelly. <laughs> <laughs> Let the audience know. Who wow. You. And we'll shut up. We'll yeah, yeah. Brian, be quiet. You're always interrupting. Oh, wait. My wife listened to an episode the other day, and she's like, oh, my gosh. You didn't let Cedric talk. You didn't let Cedric finish his question. And I'm like, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Did I, I, I totally booted you out of a question. Do you remember that? I don't remember that. Yeah, I had a feeling that Cedric didn't remember or care. <laughs> but she sure did. She's like, man, Bobby, let them speak. And now I'm not letting you speak. I'm shutting up See? right now. That's it. I'm out of the, the picture. Way. Wow. Tell us about yourself, Kelly. Um, so what would you like to know? Uh, so we we like to start with the first question of just to get to know you, you know, Where you uh, from? something, something, yeah, about your childhood or just who you are. What you were you, just telling me about chaining somebody up earlier. Chaining somebody oh, up. Oh, that was a different guess. <laughs> She's like, what? <laughs> I don't, gosh, was huh? that a, my reticulating activating <laughs> system? <laughs> <laughs> Ridiculous activating system. Yeah, that one. <clears throat> yeah. Okay. So, um, so I'm the oldest of four kids, oldest and of four kids. Um, I'm from Dallas. Dallas, Texas. <laughs> Yo, who, 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 who. Are you a Dallas Cowboy fan? Yes, I am. Of uh, course. You have to be. I mean, yes. I, that's kind of the thing. I mean, you can't. I grew up with Roger Staubach and Tony Dorsett and. And, and all that stuff. Uh -huh. and, 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 you know, even when they weren't America's team, you, you, you have to. Ryan's love signaling them to you. To let her talk. Oh, to let me talk. Dang it. Okay. <laughs> so, also Topeka, Kansas. Okay. So, back and forth, Dallas and Topeka. Um, let's see. I was. Uh, a a, a always, lively child? I've always been kind of rowdy. Yeah. Lively. Kind of yeah. My mom calls me her demon seed. Oh, that nice. That's where the chains come from. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. But nice. she says she says it jokingly because. Because you're fun. Because I'm the opposite of that. Um, yes, you are. We had a. Super power. One of my house. favorite things ever is that my basement, when I was like, like ages 9 to 12-ish, our basement had a linoleum floor, and me and my sister got the entire basement for our bedroom. So we had our beds all the way on one end, and the rest of our bedroom was oh. a skating rink. Oh, oh, nice. Yeah. Wow. It was the best. In socks or like... Roller skates, dude. Roller skates, Roller skates. baby. The whole, the whole shebang, Oh, right? yeah. Did you oh, have wow. friends come over and skate? All the we time. We loved it. Yeah. Dang. It was Did you it put was the music the on room. and like get the Yeah, ball? I had one of those little um, portable record players and we played Rhinestone Cowboy and Muskrat Love <laughs> like every a day. Rhinestone <laughs> Cowboy. <laughs> dun, dun. I that Riding song. out on a horse in mm -hmm. a star spangled rodeo. Sorry. Dude, uh, see? Uh, yeah, I you love know. it. Yeah, you know. My middle name is Glenn because of Glenn Campbell. Oh, dude. My sisters were in love with Glenn Campbell when I was born. Yeah. And my, they wanted to name me Glenn Campbell James, and my dad went, oh. uh, <laughs> no, I'll give him Glenn. That would have been awesome. And I guess that would have been cool. But Glenn Campbell James. James. Yes. Yeah. We'd have a totally different show right now. <laughs> we to yeah. <laughs> yeah, we totally. would. Totally. Yeah. Anyway. That's cool. Anyway, so yeah. Awesome. Well, tell us about what's going on. What's going on with Kelly? What 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 do you got? What's happening? What What's your movement about? Just kind of let us know. So yeah. my... Topic. My main thing is manifesting. Do you know what that is? Manifesting. Creating stuff? Yeah. Like Do you know what the law of attraction is? Law Heard of it. It's a secret. Is what yeah. It it's a secret. <laughs> yeah. That's a good one. So you know what I tell people? It's not a secret. It's not a secret. What you see is what you get. <laughs> exactly. So, hmm. so basically, uh, since I learned about how to actually use the law of attraction to stop getting all the crap in my life and start getting things I actually wanted. I was like, dude, people need to know this. I need to start teaching people this. So um, I ended up 
going to like speaker training and mentor training and I've like I have online courses and I have my website and I have clients that I mentor in this and it's amazing I have this really awesome Facebook group it's really active I teach free what's it called give us a pitch there hit it we are masters of manifesting masters of facebook.com slash we are masters Mm -hmm. of manifesting We are masters of manifesting. I love it. So I have this new thing where I do a monthly, like, topic. So we just ended people-pleasing month, which I called Stoptober. Stoptober. Stop people-pleasing. Stop people-pleasing, people. (laughs) Oh, man. (laughs) Because if you're people-pleasing, you're not using your energy to manifest what you want. You're manifesting Mm. what other people want. Yeah, but, but, but. But people won't like me. Right? Yeah. See? Oh, and I came up with a five day challenge to help people overcome that. Oh. Of people won't like me if I don't. Do you have to play. curse at people and tell them they suck? You don't. It's a really nice challenge. <laughs> I had a feeling it would be no a very cursing. positive, uplifting thing with Kelly because <laughs> no she's just positive and uplifting just to be around her energy. Yeah. Awesome. A... I'll pay you later. <laughs> <laughs> So November. She doesn't miss a beat. <laughs> November is just say no, November. Just say oh, no, just say no. And the and the uh, topic is okay. This might be a little controversial. Mm. Oh, here it comes. Dun, dun, dun. This is it. How to get through the holidays without killing your relatives. Oh, oh. Man. that right? is relevant and needed. Yeah, relevant and needed. Mm-hmm. Because <laughs> I know a lot of people really dread the holidays because they've got to spend a day with that one person that they want to throat punch all day long. Oh, it's kind of funny because you say that and then that person pops in your head when you say <laughs> I know. I know person. you've all got Did one. Everybody? Right? Oh, that person Not just at popped all. in my head. I don't know who <laughs> 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 uh, So every Monday I have a free manifesting class live in my group. Oh, on it's that group. What everybody. is it again? We are masters of manifesting. We are masters of manifesting. Facebook.com slash we are masters of manifesting. Do you meet in person ever? Um, well, we do have occasional in person things. We yeah. have one on the tenth. See? See, look at, at that. At the Spanish Fork Library downstairs. And there you go. Oh, awesome. Well, you got to tell us about all that, all those things, too, at the end of the show. We're going to talk about I'll how to get a hold of you and yeah. all that cool stuff. I'll give you links if you do links. Too. Absolutely. Yeah, okay. we put links. that on the show notes. Awesome. Yep. Only the cat links, though, not the real what? links. Yeah. You have some cat links? What? Meow. Yeah. What's a cat link? It's oh. like cat videos. I have cats. <laughs> Just take some videos of them. I'll go home and take videos of them. And yeah, and then you. link it. Yeah, it's They're <laughs> not very funny cats. Uh, really? I don't think I've ever met a cat that wasn't pretty funny. Yeah. Well. Really? Okay, I have one really fluffy cat that it, he's really cute when he plays with straws. Maybe straws, I'll do a, a video of him playing with a straw. Yeah, a cat playing with anything is just hilarious. I don't know I would, why. I'll tell you the story <laughs> after this show. One of my favorites is using the light thing, a laser. Oh, my oh, gosh, yeah. that's so hilarious. Hilarious. I haven't done that for a while. Oh, my gosh, I love that. <laughs> anyway, They're going to catch I totally got us off kilter Anyways. again. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry. Okay. If you I, guys took a straight line during an episode, I think everybody would pass out. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, I, but like, I, what show is this? <clears throat> It's not totally random. Yeah. I, was, I was just talking with my wife this morning about a certain somebody in my life that uh, we wish uh, back when she was younger would have had these types of training that you're talking about. Oh. Because now, you know, you can just see the blessings that I've had from from going and doing entrepreneur and learning and these classes things and, and, and exploring my mind. What the Going to SLB. Yeah. Anyways, some Bobby thing. Successful but, uh, life builders. But anyways, uh, what you're saying about manifesting and then uh, rich, grow rich. Rich, grow. Think and grow rich. Think and grow rich. Oh, I and, love that book. Yes. And a lot of these types of books. And mm-hmm. um, I'm just grateful for that. And we wish, you know, certain people in our lives could go back in time and <laughs> we could introduce that to them. And It's never too late to learn. Yeah. Is it, Kelly? Is it no, too late to learn? No, it's never too late to learn. Yeah. But it, it, Your it might Your mind could be, be too closed Exactly. To learn. That is the yeah. problem. But it's never too late to learn It's never too late to, to learn, yeah. but opening your mind as you get older is a little harder, I have found, for even me. 
Yeah. Mm. Yeah, it can be rough. It ta- well, it takes work. It does. You know. It's like motivation. Everything. If you don't have the motivation, you're not gonna right. care. Yep, yep. And I tell people all the time: take ten percent of your revenue and spend it on education. P- spend it on learning stuff. Oh yeah. Because y- y- mm-hmm. you will always get better by learning stuff, and especially from mentors and and yes. people and coaches and folks that have been there and done that. Yeah, definitely. Like Kelly. Mm-hmm. Could you tell us a little bit, and, 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 I, and I know I've seen you speak, could you tell us a little bit about your story, kind of where you were? Because, <laughs> I mean, it's a pretty compelling story. Yeah. Are you open to being that open? Yeah, I'm open. All right. Okay. Can I tell it? Do you have Kleenex? He, uh, uh, dude, I'm, I just let it run. <laughs> <Some> over there. <laughs> I just let it run. Uh, 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 but if you cry, I'm yeah. I'm not worried we have, about you. I might cry. Oh, oh, well, we got Kleenex. All right. So two years ago... In January, so two years ago, I was, I'd been on um, antidepressants since my son was born, and he's 13. Mm. So, I was really claustrophobic, and as he grew into my lung space, I was in a constant um, claustrophobic panic attack for three months. Mm. So, as soon as he came out, they pumped me full of everything to calm me down, and um, it just, it didn't go away, like, the crazy didn't go away, so... Gotcha. I couldn't go off it. And they kept increasing my dose until I became zombie woman. Wow. And so I was doing nothing. I was um, just, I was barely functioning. And uh, as the years went by, the drugs worked less and less. And I was on the max dose. And um, thanks. <laughs> I was spending all of my time um, escaping Netflix, video games, sleeping, eating everything in the house, anything to keep my mind off how much I sucked at everything. And then um, I got fired, which turned out to be the best thing ever, but I thought it was the end of the world when it happened. And so I went home and got worse. And stopped getting out of bed, stopped getting dressed, stopped doing anything. And then um, I got an email offering me a ticket to a three-day life-changing seminar. Mm. And I was like, dude, (laughs) I could use some life-changing. So I went to that, and I learned some stuff, and I saw a ray of light, and I started making some little changes that made a pretty big difference. And then I, while I was there, somebody offered me a ticket to a total totally different three-day life-changing seminar that was way more intense and that one was like <laughs> and you know like the paddles you know mm. it was like that to me oh wow it started your heart yeah yeah it restarted my heart restarted my life and um it just went like this geometrically up after that you just took it you grabbed on i did it, i took it and, and i said, ran like this is it this is my mm-hmm. life and i'm gonna i'm gonna live yeah totally wow. That is so cool. And then I became, I hired coaches after coach. I mean, my poor husband. I've spent so much money on coaches. <laughs> <laughs> and so I got trained you know, as but a that's interesting. A speaker. That's powerful that you say that. It, it, you do, to, to create something that you can use, and it, the money is a, is a piece that's also a part of your brain. Oh, if yeah. you don't pay for things, Mm-mm. they are not as useful. And it's just because of our brain. Mm-hmm. Uh, the more money you spend, the more powerful it is only because so. your brain connects the money to it. And, yeah. and, it, and it is interesting you say that, but, it, but, it's, but it's true. When, when you can't, and, and I get it, a lot of people are like, I don't have any money to, to spend on stuff. So what yeah. do I do? Well, there's places, there's books. I mean, you come on, yeah. you gotta, you got to be able to spend you know, fourteen dollars a month on Audible. Come on, right? I mean, you could. You, I've learned a lot <laughs> from Audible, man. I know, right? <laughs> Audible's amazing. Yeah, but anyway, it, it's powerful to to pay to learn to grow. It is super cool. And you can't get new results doing the same stuff you've been doing. And you can't if if you're stuck in it, you don't know where the better behaviors are. Mm-mm. You don't know which way to go. Because nope. you've never been there. It's like, so true. you know, foreign territory to you. So it makes a huge difference. That's so cool. And Thanks. now you're 
spreading the same stuff. I know. And you're, you, and, and who knows how many people you have pulled out of the bed. Yeah, that's a good way to put it. Pulled yeah. out of the bed. That's yeah. amazing. That's so cool. I love that you named your um, website. I am, I love awesome. <laughs> that is that's so, that from is that so dark, awesome. That dark, <laughs> that dark space to taking it on that's I love awesome I mean you can't yeah you can't go to that site and not feel pretty excited about stuff <laughs> yeah I love awesome too <laughs> man yeah <laughs> yeah cool wow well we had you know we get we get connected and then we get quieter yeah <laughs> yeah <laughs> thank you funny, Kelly for for connecting us and 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 really feeling that spirit because thank you you're welcome. Uh, it's it's important, and that that's why we're here, doing the biz for good show, because it's people like you that are changing the world, and making it a better place. Thanks. Because you took it on. Yeah. Because because some people don't. No. And they either die or live a miserable life. Yeah. They so s- thank you. They stay zombie mom. Yeah. So thank you for taking that challenge and kicking some butt. You're welcome. Because you are. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> I like kicking butt. No, Ryan, taking names. Do you want to ask the question? Yeah, it's the question. The, the yes, name. I will marry you. Oh, oh wow! Whoops. Wait, I'm married Pop already. The question. <laughs> Isn't that the big question? Pop, yeah. She's right. That <laughs> is. <laughs> uh, well, not on the biz for good show. <laughs> I'd be married a lot. <laughs> yeah. The big. You would. You'd get married every week. <laughs> yeah. It's very oh, controversial yeah. stuff going on. <laughs> it's so crayly in here. It, cray- it is kind of crayly, man. We're getting all crayly in it. <laughs> cray crayly. Cray crayly. I absolutely love that, dude. That is the <laughs> coolest You know, it's the way I work. Roll crayly. <laughs> Anyways, the question is, what does being good in business mean to you or biz for good mean to <sighs> Kelly Walker? To me, it means making a difference. Because, I mean, there's so much dark out there. So much. I, I try to not see it. Like, I don't watch TV. I don't listen to the news. I just... She's a fellow spirit. I just choose yeah. to have, you know, the Kelly vision as much as possible. And yes, what is wrong with that? You know, people tell me... I my know. mother. My mother really I gets get angry. I get a lot of She's like, for it. Why do you not watch the news? You need to know what's going on. And I'm like, Mom, if it's really important, you'll call me. Exactly. <laughs> That's what I say too. If it's really important, someone will tell me. Yeah, yeah. So. It, 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 there is nothing wrong with surrounding yourself with positive goodness. I agree. I, I just, it, you're in the clouds, Bobby. So what? Yeah. My life is crap loads better because I'm it in the is. clouds. Right? Yeah. Thank you. You're Thank welcome. you for pointing that out. You're welcome. There is nothing wrong with that. It's a powerful, powerful thing because it is what you see is what mm-hmm. you create. Yeah, exactly, and what you focus on grows. Yep. So if you focus on and the good stuff, you get the good more stuff. good stuff, right? Oh, it's, it's like so a, cool! It's like wow, a magic that. bag or something. It it, it, it is really is. Bag. It's mm-hmm. it's not a secret. It's a crazy but it, magic it, bag. It, and and even magically, it's science. It's, it's science. It science. Like you said, with the reticular it's activating your reticular activating system. It. it it is a physical, real thing yeah, that what sure. you focus on is what grows in your life. Mm-hmm. And that's not woo-woo. That's not magical stuff. Yeah. That's science. Yep. Totally science. Powerful science. <laughs> I have so much in my head right now, I want to just... <laughs> blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Share some of your head with us. <laughs> I'm, I am a big uh, Ghost Adventures fan, and... Uh, <laughs> and, and the last night they had a thing, and uh, I'm a, almost done with the. Is the, that a the, show? Yeah, it's a show. We're, we're talking about what we focus on right now becomes our manifest. <laughs> you focus on ghosts. And no, the, the the host I'm noticing is getting darker and darker um, because he's focusing on the dark so much, oh, and I'm really worried. <laughs> Really You're worried, worried about her. I'm like, dude, you keep going down this path, we're not going to have you much longer. Mm. Anyways, it was really dark That's last true. night. That's too bad. Yeah. Anyways, it was just it, I was thinking about this very same thing. It's like what we focus, focus on. on is what we get, and I just want to yeah. slap the guy because he's focused on the wrong thing. Right and now. what you put out into the world, you, <clears throat> you bring back to you also. Yeah, yep. and, and it Comes showed right it back. showed that part too. By the way, in this thing. What? 
Yeah. It's, I, I got so much. Pain. Yeah, I'll just go. Go for I it. I don't want to. Give it to us. Good Let thing us have I'm not like, like an NB, Good thing I'm not NBC or anything. Anyway. <clears throat> yeah. It's okay. You can yeah. talk about the show. Yeah. It's no. been on the air. Okay, so he has a museum in Las Vegas. It's a haunted museum, right? And he collects go every figure. He <laughs> haunted museum, <laughs> right? He collects um, artifacts that are haunted, or, or he has the Jack Tavorkian van. He has all these horrible, morbid things in his ma- mansion. And they've noticed since they built this ma- this haunted museum that all this crazy stuff happens around the property: arrests, people getting beat up. Because of the dark going, energy there. Yep. There's exactly. So much negative energy, the energy. coming from him. Anyways, yep. so it's real, you, people. It is real. Again, I, it is not magical stuff. It mm-hmm. is real, real, I, real. It's what, science. Yes, yeah. I just wanted to point that out. You know what I mean? Yeah, absolutely. Well, Kelly, mm-hmm. thank you for being on the show and bringing you're your so amazing welcome. spirit because you're such a cra- crazy, <laughs> amazing, fantabulous <laughs> fan. Excellent. Womanastic. Oh, she has, She she is very womanastic. Very well, womanastic. That's womanastic. I like it, that. It's a fantastically woman. <laughs> like Wonder Woman? Is she woman? What's the word? Womanastic. Womanastic. Is Wonder Woman womanastic? Oh, you're yeah. kidding me. Of course. She's like, like, she like woman started the woman. womanastic. Awesome. I love that. Yes. <laughs> yes. That's is what, that's Brene an, Brown womanastic? Oh, of course. Oh, Brene good. Brown is, a, okay. it, is absolutely womanastic. Dude. She's yeah. a fantastic woman. Womanastic. He called me mentabulous a couple episodes. Mentabulous. <laughs> yes. So and then we needed a lady woman, one, too. So we went with womanastic. 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 Yes. Fantastic. So you're womanastic. You're womanastic. Dude, we're cool. <laughs> <laughs> we're crazy, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, action. oh yeah, action item. Gosh, what's the action item that you would like to give our listeners? This, okay. I, I just feel like we've just been hanging out with Kelly, and it's been just really fun. Because yep. she's just, her spirit is just so bubbly. Cool to sparkles. be around. Sparkles. Sparkles. It does sparkle. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? It. We had to, we have to, do you watch Tony Robbins? Yes. Okay, so, um, so Chris Crow and I go to his events a lot. If you put, beep out yeah. the F words, you, you don't get much. Well, he doesn't say it all the time. <laughs> but he has this thing where you need to change your state. Like if you're feeling low low energy and you mm-hmm. want to be have positive energy, to make a move. He said, like, pick a power move and do it. Like and do you want to see Do you want to see what my power move is? Yeah, oh, absolutely. I'll Get do this it sitting again. down. Get it on the front, what, front version. Okay. My headphones. Okay, ready? Oh, wait. Why it's is frozen. It, why is it stuck? Oh, it's on. Oh, no, he changed cameras. <laughs> That's okay. You can. Do you want me to do it to this camera? Yes. Okay. Ready? Yes. Sparkle cannons. <laughs> sparkle. That's me shooting sparkles of happiness through the world. <laughs> <laughs> do you like it? That's I my sparkle metal. cannons. I feel it, man. I'm like, sparkle sh- cannons. I got that just stuff in my hair. Now. All over. Lucky. Feel that energy. Ooh. I sparkled all over you. Yeah, I sparkled you know. all over you. Oh. And I got married. I got sparkled. <laughs> <laughs> man, this show. Lots <laughs> happened on the show today. <laughs> Uh, so what what kind of action yes, item action. can you can you can you give the Kay. the listeners? So my favorite thing that I do every day during my power hour. You guys have a power hour, right? Yes, every, absolutely. In the good. morning. Good. Okay. Morning. During mine, I read my manifesto, oh. and that is like a like me claiming what I want mm. as if it is mine already with gratitude. Your life's vision type of thing. Yeah, kind of. Yeah, but mm-hmm. more. I don't know. More powerful. More oomph. Yeah, more oomph. Boom, boom. And so what, what I do with m- most of my clients is, is that I help them write these power statements. Mm. And, you know, you can make it as long or short as you want. So um, my action step would be for everyone to create a little mini manifesto right now of one thing that they really want to start having in their lives. Oh, you're going to my website? And um, so there's three P's, okay? Make your sentences start with I am, because that's the most I powerful sentence in the yes. world. I am. Mm-hmm. And then use the three P's. Make it personal, only about you, because you can't change other people. Positive, so don't say words like um, can't or don't or quit. Or I stop. won't be a bad person. Yeah, yeah. Don't use <laughs> any okay. negative words. Right. And make it present tense as if you've already accomplished it. So... 
Do you want to hear the beginning of my manifesto? Of course we that's do. What I, that's what I brought my phone oh, over. Oh, absolutely. We it's want to long, hear It's long, but I'm just going to read the first paragraph. Okay? okay, just read the first paragraph. Are you ready Te- for this? Be, this is, yeah, it's a teaser. This is powerful. Okay. My name is Kelly Walker, and I am a force of nature. Mm-hmm. I get everything I want, and that makes the world a better place because what I want is to be my best, highest self physically, financially, and in all my roles and relationships. I have total integrity in my commitment to be my highest self. Every day I make forward progress. I am full of gratitude for everything I am and have. Wow, that's That's the first paragraph. Sorry, but I need more. Yeah, but we only have two minutes before the... The uh, recorder cuts off. Okay. <laughs> we'll have to catch you on another I can time. tell you later, yeah. or when you have me back, I can read it. I can read the whole thing. Absolutely. Kelly, thank you so much for being on the show. Yes, I so, so cool. You're a powerhouse, thank changing you. the world, living the be good, do good in a, in a powerful, powerful way. Thank you. Thank you for thank having you for me on here. Double yes. thank you. It was you. so fun. Absolutely. Uh, a, a sincere Crayley. Thank you. Yeah, a sincere crazy. <laughs> you guys are mantabulous. <laughs> <laughs> and you're womanastic. Yes. <laughs> All right, Ryan, oh, you're going to take man. us out? This oh, but awesome. first, give us any links and stuff. Any links that you want? I know you've um, kind of given them. Any, any place else you want people to go? Um, well, oh of gosh. course, go to iloveawesome.com. I have two free gifts on there. So um, the top five ways you're accidentally blocking what you want the most, if you put your little information at the bottom, you'll get a little thing on how to actually stop repelling what you want. Mm -hmm. There you go. And then I also have my five day stop people pleasing challenge. And it's in a little just ribbon across the top of my website. I love it. And see, oh there it is, see across the top, are you a people pleaser? Take my free five day stop people pleasing challenge, click here at the very, very top. So, right there. anybody here. who wants some awesome free training, go click on this those. This is a great place to start. Yep. Awesome, Kelly. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Ryan? Yeah, we all, always end the show with the three hashtags. Hashtag be good, do good. Be good, do good. Do good. Anyways, hashtag <laughs> be, be good, do good. good. Hashtag be good, do good. Hashtag be good. Do good!